Gen 3 dryer functions. So we have on the top row, we have the top spiral, which is actually the top and the bottom spiral down there. If we turn this on, we can control the vertical spiral, which brings the powder up into it. So we cut the top spiral on, both the bottom and the top are working. And we turn the vertical spiral on, and it'll start to bring powder up. See how it's bringing it up now? And we don't want to run this all the time, but this just recycles the powder for it. Okay? The vertical spiral will not cut on unless the top spiral is cut on. Next button is the step auto. Step is the belt controller. When we have the step auto on, it does not turn the belt on until the film is in front of the sensor down there, and that's the sensor. So we can actually, to finish a job, we can turn the step manual on, and it makes the belt move. Powder Auto will actually turn the powder shaker on and you can adjust the volume right here by how much it dumps. So if you look right here, turn the volume up, okay, we can turn the volume up or down and then we also, the next switch will be the powder manual. So when we cut the powder manual on, let's say we want to get a job started, we cut the manual on, it automatically dumps. On, automatically dumps, off, does not. And you can also adjust the volume right here of how much powder is dropped in the manual. Um, right here is the preheat button. set at 22 degrees Celsius and this actually is the preheat table so it it dries the film as it, before it goes into the dryer um, and then we have the oven dry and you adjust the temperature right here up and down once we start a run we want to make sure the vacuum is on and the vacuum is actually going to pull back in right here in the front side and then in the back side of the dryer. This is going to hold the film down during the curing process. Last on this we have the powder clear. <clears throat> so when we turn the powder clear on the film will actually come out of the printer, drop down into the chamber, come back up, it's filled with powder, comes back over this, and then it'll sit right here. And that's how we start it. So when the run starts, the printer runs, feeds film, gets down to the sensor, cuts on this, and as it's coming back up, it's beating the extra powder off of it, and our duster is dusting it. Um, here we have some, uh, we can adjust the belt speed, we can adjust the belt time, the powder timer, but, um, and down there is a, a breaker that we use to cut on and off the machine. Um, another thing is, and we'll go over this next, is setting up the take-up reel. Basics, this is the basics on the Gen 3 duster.